short week. It was our first new liturgy schedule yesterday, so hopefully no one got left at school for too long. Make sure you fill out an application on the student website to go to Homeboy Industries in Los Angeles. For more information, go see Mr. Hurt into sales. Now to Nadia to learn more about the Senior Overnighter. Hi Dons, I'm here with Mr. Filippone interviewing him about the Senior Overnighter. So, what exactly is the Senior Overnighter? Uh, the Senior Overnighter is a big slumber party slash dance party for seniors here at Cathedral Catholic. How can students sign up for the event? Uh, students can sign up online under the student section on the CCHS website. So what would you recommend students bring and what should they not bring? Uh, I would recommend bringing food uh, for you, snacks, candy, whatever you want. Um, bring a sleeping bag, blankets, maybe a camping mat. Uh, what you can't bring are tents, air mattresses, uh, air furniture, uh, liquids, coolers, and George Foreman grills. Is there an admissions fee for students and what's provided? Uh, there is no admissions uh, fee. It's to absolutely free. Uh, what is provided are uh, sodas, water, um, so liquids we provide. You bring your own food. Uh, you can have even have food delivered to you. Great. So thank you so much for your time, Mr. Filipponi. And Dons, if you have any more questions, feel free to stop by at CC106. Mr. Filipponi will be happy to answer any questions, or you can directly just shoot him an email. Good morning, Dons. Today I'm here with the Model UN Club to see what it's all about and to see if you should be part of World Affairs. Let's find out. So what is the Model UN Club? So for anyone who isn't familiar with the UN or what the UN does, the UN is basically an organization that deals primarily with maintaining peace and cooperation between nations. And so what we do as high school students is we basically put on a mock version of the actual conferences that are held at the UN and we deal with different social and economic issues and basically put our heads together to kind of tackle these issues. How can students sign up? So we're going to be around during club week and you'll definitely see us there. So just come up to our table and you can write your name down on the sign up and we'll be sure to link you in all of our emails. When will you guys be having events and how can students show up? So our first event is going to be held in October. It's actually going to be at UCSD. It's going to be our first conference of the year and students who come to our club meetings and actively participate will get an invitation extended to them to attend the conference. So be sure to check out the Model UN Club and we hope to see you there. Hey Dons, today I'm asking people what they would say to their freshman self. Let's go. Don't procrastinate on homework. Don't use self tanner Keep it up, girl. Homework done, school's first and important. Um, Don't wear that. Pull your skirt. Don't be quiet at football games. Don't do your eyebrows like that. Hit the gym and get you. Hey Dons, the field hockey team won its first home game against Point Loma last week and plays CCA tonight at five. Good luck ladies. The cross country team has the Bronco Invitational at Rancho Bernardo this Saturday. Good luck to all those competing. And our girls volleyball team suffered a hard loss to Torrey Pines last Thursday, but has another opportunity to defend their top 10 ranking Saturday as they play Redondo Union in LA. Redondo took the Dons out of state CIF last year, so this is definitely a game to keep track of. And your Dons won the honorable this weekend against number nine, Saguaro. So come out tonight as they play number six, Centennial. The theme is tie-dye. Head over to the ASB room for a Dons tie-dye shirt and check out the Los Locos Instagram for more information. And in anticipation of the ongoing U.S. Open, your Dons news team has been working with the tennis team. Here's what they learned. What's up guys, it's d -Woo. We made it to the tennis courts. I'm here with senior captain on the girls varsity tennis team. How, you, how is your guys' team looking this year? Um, our team this year is looking really good. We're a team of a lot of younger people. It's a majority of new teams, so we're just kind of getting in the groove, getting to know each other, finding our partners, and seeing how we play as a team. What schools are you guys playing this upcoming week? This upcoming week we're going to be playing Rancho Bernardo, Coronado, and Santa Margarita. It's a bitch. <laughs> Don't just cut out that last part. I Obviously, besides yourself, who are some other standout players? Um, some other standout players are definitely my co-captains Julia Straza and Victoria Cervantes. Um, some younger people we have is Georgia Kimmel, Jackie Mossy, Gianna Rapetti, Grace Gatze, Ava Woods, Debbie Eggers, everyone on the team is really great. We have a lot of fun standout players. Tune in.
to next week's the nah, nah. <laughs> Alright guys, so tune in to this upcoming week's tennis matches and come cheer the girls varsity tennis team on. Alright. Well, that's a wrap.